I'm going to show you guys exactly how to take any Instagram picture, any Pinterest picture, and just put your AI model into it, like these ones. You no longer need to prompt till your brain pops out. If you've been doing this, you know that it can take you an entire day to do this, to just get the image that you want. So I'm going to show you exactly how to do it, right? All you need to do is find an image that you like on Pinterest. I like to use Pinterest, copy that image and copy your AI model's image and then go to wave speed, right? Once you go to wave speed, you just click on the C dream edit model, right? And it's going to look something like this, this one. And then it's going to give you something like this. So I'm going to show you guys exactly how to do it. All you need to do is just go to chat GPT, put in this prompt and say, how can I prompt C dance to put one character, my AI model into the second image, which is the real image, right? And then chat GPT is going to give you a prompt, right? Now, can you emphasize, I'm going to just say, can you emphasize the blondes? features so it doesn't give me the brunette's features like hair eyes skin tone because in the interest of time i've done this and the prompt that i use gave me a brunette right and i want a blonde so i'm just going to ask it ahead of time and then i'm going to take this and then place it in here now at the end of my prompt, I like to just say emphasize realistic skin tones, nighttime lighting, and natural amateur photo look. And you can even specify, you know, iPhone 17. I like to do that. So let's copy and paste that and then see what it gives me. Now, while that is loading, I actually want to try and see if it's going to work with pictures where it's more than one person because you know when you, you want to upload pictures of your AI model and you want it to look realistic what do realistic models or real models have friends as well so I want to see if that's going to work so I'm just going to copy this image and place it in here and ask ChatGPT there now I don't like that her eyes are so emphasized it kind of looks a little weird it's giving alien so I'm going to take away the blue eyes and then do it again. Okay. So I, while that is going, I asked ChatGPT to basically just use this image of her friend and just replace one character. So I said, can you do this too? Using the blonde as a reference image, make sure to keep the brunette and replace the blonde. So basically what I'm asking is, I want to, let me zoom in here. I wanted to keep this lady and then just replace this lady. So let's see, copy. Let's see how this looks like. I like this one, but it looks too corporate -y, you know? Uh, I'm gonna say wavy hair, and then I am going to replace the fact that keep the restaurant setting, table and clothes. Let's see. Okay, so now for the second image, I have taken this image, copied it, and I am going to put it in here. You guys can, I'm going to put the prompts in the description, by the way. So I'm going to wait this. Do, 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 do. Also, guys, for pictures that are a bit further apart, the facial images aren't going to look that great. So what I like to do is download this image and then just go to enhancer and if you just put it in here directly it's going to tell you the image is too big right so what you need to then do is just go to canva same image and then just place her in there download it and then you can place her in here now that is for images that are a bit further apart because as you can see look at this the image kind of looks a little blurry so what you're going to do is put it in here the same image coming from Canva and then just enhance it. So I'm not going to do that because I'm trying to preserve my credits. So you can do that and then enhance the image. Sometimes it's a hit or miss, but other times it does work, right? Perfect. So now that we have that, I am going to use this prompt, put it in here. I'm going to keep that emphasize. And then I am going to just download this image and put it into C Dream. 
and then go. What I actually want to show you guys is this, this image that I enhanced. See, sometimes it does it, other times it's not that great, right? It's not a major improvement from what we've had. And I was doing this image. Where is this image? Let me see. Oh, so from here to here, it does something, right? So, yeah. Okay, now that that is done, let's see. Oh, I kind of like it, you know? So I am going to... Every time I say blue eyes, it just gives me exaggerated blue eyes. So I'm going to take away the blue eyes and say she has wavy hair. Wavy blonde hair. While that is waiting, I want to show you guys some of the other images that I did to just show you guys what works and what does not. Some of the fails that I've had. So look here. If the image or the person that you're trying to put your AI model in looks very different, this is how the images are going to look like. This is a Asian girl, I believe, or a black girl. See, it's like, it looks good. I can still use it, but her lips kind of look a little overlined here and her nose looks the same as this model. So just bear that in mind, right? This is another one that was a fail. So bear that in mind, not everything is going to work and it does not matter how much you prompt it. I've tried it's so many fail. I've literally said same facial features, create a new image. Do not just impaint. Trust me, I've tried that and it still doesn't want to. So I just move on if that's the case. Ooh, I like it. I like this image. What do you guys think? What you guys think? I really like it. Is it different from the original? Oh my God, it's very, it's giving the same. So let's actually rerun that. Thank God I looked and it looks a little weird. So let's try again. The first one worked, but let's see with this one. Still the same exact image. I don't know who that is. The first one was good. So what I do recommend is that you guys just keep trying until you get it right. But if you see that it's not working, just leave it alone and move on to the next picture. Sometimes I even like to start a new entire thing as in a new page on a new tab with CDream instead of just using the images that I've used. These were some fails as well. As you can see the girl looks, is this an Asian girl or a black girl? So it starts off great and then it just, see she has a third leg that's just going into a different way. So that is it. I hope you guys like this video and I am going to be running a challenge to start from scratch to grow your AI model on Instagram. So if you guys would like to join the challenge, just look in the description below to join the Facebook group to join the challenge. So that is it. And I'll see you in the next video.